the little bully class 5 english do you know of any child who teases others or pushes them around what would you call such a child read the story and see how hurry a little boy troubles other children once upon a time not so very long ago there was a small boy called hari although he wasn't very big he was strong and he loved to tease all the boys and girls who went to school with him what he loved to do most was to pinch he could make a big bruise appear in a half second another trick he played was pricking people with a pin so you can guess how all the children hated him they tried pinching him back but that was no good because he could always pinch harder they didn't like telling that teachers because that was telling tales it so happened that the class went for a picnic to the seaside for a whole day all the children were most excited on that day the sun shone bright and all the children were wild with excitement they crowded into the train and sat down but nobody wanted to sit next to hari because he always pinched when they arrived at the seaside out jumped all the children with a shout of joy down to the sands they raced hand in hand but nobody took hari's hand nobody went near him hari was angry he went to a sandy corner near a rocky pool and sat down by himself he took out his lunch and looked at it it was a good lunch there were two hard boiled eggs six jam sandwiches three pieces of bread and butter a ginger cake and a bar of chocolate he would eat it all by himself he wouldn't offer anything to anyone Just as he was beginning on the eggs he heard a hoarse voice near him Good morning I am so pleased to meet a boy like you Hari turned around and stared in fright Whatever do you think he saw Hari saw a monster crab walking sideways out of the pool His eyes were on the ends of the short stalks and he looked most queer. He held out his front claw to Hari. Hari put out his hand to shake the crab's claw. But to his surprise and anger, the crab opened his pincers and nipped his hand so hard that the little boy yelled. Ah here is my good cousin said the crab pleasantly and to hari's horror he saw a large sandy lobster crawling heavily out of the pool before the little boy could stop him the lobster took his hand in his great pincers like claw and pinched it so hard that hari yelled in pain then he stared at the pool in surprise for out came sandy colored shrimps and prawns more crabs and another large lobster and they pricked hari till he was soon black and blue with their pinching don't you like it said all the creatures in surprise why we were told you would love to see us because 
you were a champion pincer and pricker yourself come come join in the fun hari leapt to his feet crying loudly his lunch rolled into the pool and when the crabs and lobsters saw it they ran to it and began to feast eagerly hari saw that they had forgotten him for a time and he turned and ran for his life tears streaming down his cheeks they only did to me what i keep doing to other children he thought but how it hurt and how i hated those crabs and lobsters i suppose the other children hate me too well i jolly well shall not pinch or prick any more